So environmental biology is the scientific study of uh, the origins, functions, uh, relationship, biotic interactions between species, communities, populations, uh, and ecosystems. And it's all sort of done against the background of uh, a range of environmental variables. So the course within uh, uh, environmental biology is delivered face-to-face uh, -face, uh, in the form of uh, small group tutorials, hands-on practicals, uh, field trips uh, down to different habitats uh, in and around UCD or close to UCD, uh, and face-to-face -face lectures as well. The classes, uh, as you move through the degree program, become more focused. Uh, and so our numbers are on average about 20 to 25 students in those lectures and in those practicals. So students uh, entering into an environmental biology degree program, within their first year, they come in via common entry into science within UCD, where they undertake modules uh, on maths, biology, uh, and chemistry. And this sets them up uh, within their environmental biology program to lead into their second year where they, they begin to choose uh, principles in terms of their specific uh, program area. In your third year, you become really more specialized in environmental biology. So you will take modules that look at systems ecology, wildlife and conservation. We begin to uh, uh, drive those practical elements of survey design, experimental design. We take lots and lots of field courses within that third year, and we also go on a big field course over to Spain, looking at the biogeography of species, looking at differences between different countries within Europe, uh, and that all builds towards heading into your final year uh, within your degree program, where you get to choose a research area uh, from a selection of, of, of projects that are put forward by all of the academics within the schools and uh, research groups. And a student then takes a big research project within their chosen discipline. So an environmental student will have a choice of environmental biology and uh, 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 projects that they will select from marine or terrestrial or freshwater systems. So what's also an option within a uh, fourth year of your environmental uh, biology program is uh, an optional trip to Costa Rica. That trip to Costa Rica uh, over to uh, a tropical rainforest uh, sort of brings together all that knowledge that you've developed over your degree program, particularly within the third and fourth years as you're becoming more specialized towards environmental biology. So in terms of work placements and study abroad um, within your degree program, um, the School of Biology and Environmental Science has very strong links with industries and government agencies. And within your third year, there's an option uh, to take uh, work placement and along with, uh, within uh, environmental consultancies, within uh, national agencies or local governments. Uh, in terms of study abroad, students in the past that have taken the environmental uh, biology degree program uh, have studied abroad in Australia, California, and New Zealand with universities that we have links there with. Work opportunities for graduates of the environmental degree program include fisheries managers, wildlife and conservation officers, habitat ecologists, pollution ecologists, working as biodiversity officers within local government, working for national agencies, and of course, uh, within your graduate program, it also facilitates your entry into academia if you want to take up master's programs or further education within uh, PhD programs, with that culmination that you potentially can become an academic yourself. I would recommend this course to students with a very keen interest in the natural world, uh, with an inquisitive mind, want to understand how we as humans are impacting that natural world, how that natural world is changing through our behaviours as a society, and indeed students that want to know what is the future of our natural world in terms of global climate change uh, and, and predicted future human impacts.